became EP1 electric superbike promises 500 km range. A Bengaluru-based tech startup called Mankam Automotive has started a crowdfunding program to build the Mankam EP1, an electric sport bike which is claimed to eventually have a range of over 500 km on a single charge. The EP1 will use a high-density battery pack and compatible motor controller combination giving it a total range of 480 km on a full charge, at speeds of 70 kmph on the highway, and a range of 500 to 550 km in the city, with active regenerative braking. The Mankam EP1 will have three riding modes with a maximum speed of 251 kmph. The liquid-cooled 18.4 kWh battery pack uses a combination of high-density Samsung cells that make up the entire battery pack, with dedicated matrix BMS system to monitor and control individual cells providing high levels of safety and efficiency, the company, headed by Swapnil Mankam, says. Also read. Mflux builds India's first electric superbike Our vision is to build the most affordable and reliable electric superbike in the world that beats petrol-powered motorbikes in their own field, the company says. We are a team of engineers, developing what will be India's first electric superbike named the EP1. The electric superbike will be comparable to 600-650cc motorbikes with internal combustion engines in terms of performance with a top speed of 250 kmph. The EP1 will have a belt final drive connected to a 40 kW high-performance motor The rear wheel of the EP1 is driven by an Aramid Kevlar reinforced belt drive system connected to a 40 kW high-performance PMSM motor with 180 Nm at the shaft and 432 Nm at the wheel resulting in quiet operation and increased torque jerk tolerance and eliminating any lubrication needs. The braking system consists of dual 320mm front discs and a 240mm rear disc with Brembo calipers, reinforced with dual-channel intelligent ABS and traction control with machine learning developed in-house. So far, Final production timelines have not been disclosed about the Mankam EP1. The EP1 will have a fully adjustable Allens upside down fork with a stroke of 120 mm and an optional Allens TTX GP rear shock. The standard rear suspension will be a Showa pressurized shock with 30 mm stroke. The EP1 will have a curb weight of just 160 kg with a ground clearance of 190 mm. The EP1 will be built in Darwet, Karnataka and will have three different riding modes. In economy mode, the bike can go up to a speed of 120 kmph, while in sport mode, maximum speed will be restricted to 180 kmph. In race mode, the EP1 is expected to have speed limited to 251 kmph. For the latest auto news and reviews, follow Car and Bike on Twitter, Facebook, and subscribe to our YouTube channel.